Hi guys, how Hello. are you? <laughs> Great. It's just excellent. How does it feel to have a show tonight here in the middle of all this? This must be the most beautiful place to have a show uh, ever. <laughs> I don't think we've ever done something like this. It actually feels more like shooting a music video because you're you mm -hmm. usually we're packed pretty tight and now we're like, you know, you stand on that rock and you climb to that yeah. tree and you know, whatever. I think it feels pretty black metal. Yeah, feels kind like of. This, doing like some black metal This stuff. is totally this Norwegian is really cool. also, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Can you tell me something about this place? What is this? This is our home. Yeah, uh, made of stone. Yeah. So it must have taken some strength to build all this. Do you think that Finnish women are stubborn maybe? We are stubborn, we are strong. Yeah. And we never give up, yeah. independent. Yeah. Yeah, it takes some serious willpower to, you know, <laughs> actually see something like this through. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah. Do you think that Finns are especially connected to the forest somehow? Do you feel connected to the nature or the forest? I used to be a scout girl when I was a kid and uh, I always feel okay this this sounds like some weird stuff but it's always like uh, to be connected with the nature is always very important and uh, I think everyone is connected to the nature of course mm -hmm. and we are part of it mm -hmm. and if you want to go uh, like in the woods and be alone. Uh, it's very possible in Finland. Why do you think Finland is such a metal country? Fin Finland is pretty open country. It's like it's pretty easy to start start the metal band. And also the music education is pretty good. There's a lot of good musicians here. We have such you know amazingly skilled musicians and bands who never get anywhere yeah. because there's just not enough people to attend to all the shows. And then we have the darkness and the cold winter and yeah. all yeah. that. So I think metal music really fits yeah. to yeah. that yeah. really, really well. Yeah, and I think like, all, you know, all the Finnish, you know, big pop songs and the Schlager songs, they're always like super sad. Even the fucking Finnish Christmas carols are like, my yeah, dog died, really my sad. mom died, I am sick, I'm, I'm gonna die. Yeah. So, you know, <laughs> you know it, it only fits that, you know, the general attitude of metal fits that pretty well. Yeah. 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 Finnish Christmas songs are yeah, really they're metal. Yeah, super they're fucking metal. depressing. Yeah. <laughs> Tell us a memory from Tuska Festival. Uh, we have actually, well, yeah. A lot of memories come Definitely. <laughs> Also, some memories which have been wiped out for yes. some reason. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, I remember our last show in Tuska, and it was one of the best shows ever. Yeah. Like I felt like mentally that I could explode because yeah. I was so excited. And yeah, it, it's pretty funny. I mean, we have played in you know a lot of places and many exotic places, and you know all over the world. But for some reason, I think all the the most emotional shows are always in Helsinki mm. because you got your friends watching you, you got your maybe your parents mm. or whatever. Everybody who knows you is mm. there, and that's yeah. I mean, that is more you know uh, stressful. Yeah, yeah, it's much easier to <coughs> perform to people who you who you yeah. really don't know. Mm. <coughs> but when you know that there's your family and mm. friends, yeah. um, it's there's a lot of lot more in stake somehow. Yeah. Mm. yeah. Yeah, but I think the Tuska shows are always the ones that you remember after the summer, mm. because there's always mm. kind of a special, uh, how do you, how, how would you put it, special atmosphere and a yeah. Yeah. sense of anticipation for each of those. All over the world comes people there, and, and yeah. not just Finnish people. So it's a great yeah. metal meeting. Mm. Yeah. And the after parties can be. <laughs> <laughs> Sounds amazing. Uh, looking forward to your next Tuska show. 2020 has been different, to say the least. How do you see the future? Well, I mean, nobody knows the future, but I think already, I think this whole, you know, the plague, the, the, the COVID, the coronavirus, whatever you want to call it, is, is, you know, it's actually been super weird. Yeah, I mean, not, not just in a bad way, because to be honest, like if you play a hundred shows in a year, then you know, none of the shows are that special to be honest but like this year we played okay we did one tour in uh, january february but after that like each show has been like you'd be really pumped for it because they're very special yeah. and that, that's actually a good feeling 
you know, to, it kind of feels like we were a young band again when we did like, you know, 10 shows a year. Yeah, yeah I really miss miss touring and and being interactive with the audience. Mm -hmm. But uh, to find something positive, we have started writing new songs for for the next album. And mm -hmm. So always have to be positive and mm. try to think what else can you do while you are not touring or or doing some shows. Exactly. This year has really taught us to appreciate things that we've maybe taken for granted before. Absolutely. Yeah. What we are shooting here today is called Tuska Utopia and a utopia is a state or a place of ideal perfection. What would your utopia be like? I think it would also be something, you know, nature themed. I mean, not, not you know, as something as radical as, you know, building, having my own castle in the forest, but yeah. something in the way, like getting, you know, closer to the Yeah, it would be nature. like that you could stay in the forest without mosquitoes. Yes. No bears which eat you alive. Yeah. And then unlimited Ed, yeah. power. Yeah, stuff like and that. And yeah. that your cell phone would still work perfectly and <laughs> never run out of battery, you know. Yeah. And that food delivery yeah. would work and yeah. that kind of stuff. <laughs> what do you dream of? Yeah. What I'm looking forward is to do this show today. Yeah. And I'm dreaming of the show. Yes. I'm which dreaming. is going to happen in 15 minutes. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. On, the, on, on the map. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Anyway. One last question. What's the most useless talent you have? Playing, playing the guitar. bass. It's <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> only ever brought useless. me trouble. Yeah. yeah. I, I don't have any useless. <laughs> <laughs> now that I think of you guys, you know this too. Uh, I'm very good at uh, selective hearing. All right. That's, oh, that's, <laughs> that is very true. Is, yeah. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. I'm sorry. <laughs>